Hello everyone. Today I am going to show you something that my grandma used to make every time around this year. In January, beginning of February, it was her favorite thing around her birthday time. It's an old German recipe. It's Glutwein. In other words, hot spiced wine. And all we're going to do is take your favorite red wine and I have Pio Noir it's a 750 milliliter bottle all right pour in our red wine And when I add this next ingredient, some of you might go, oh, wow, that's a lot. One and a half cup sugar. Then, a capful of almond extract. Then, the most important ingredient, cinnamon stick. But you got to make sure you get a certain kind of cinnamon. I can't remember what this is called. Um, but we get this at um, the one natural store in town. And we're going to get it all mixed up and stirred up. Turn it on to low... And we're going to let it cook on low for about 15 to 20 minutes. The longer you let it cook, the better it gets. The more it steeps, the more the cinnamon cooks in. But I think it's best. And my grandma always did it on low for about 15 to 20 minutes. So it just heats up and all the sugar and the cinnamon and everything just starts to incorporate. There we go. We're going to let it be, and we'll be back. Mmm. So beautiful. Now, when it's cooked, a lot of times, you see how it swells and opens up, and then you get little pieces in there. That's why it's really important that we do this. It's a little tea cozy on top of our drink and let's get ourselves poured a glass oops nice warm spiced wine in my house, we have it right around the end of January, beginning of February, to celebrate my grandma's birthday, who passed on, to honor one of her Christmas traditions. And there we have it, a nice, warm, steamy cup of German Loop vine. Hot spiced wine. Thanks for coming along and I hope you enjoyed this video. Can't wait to see you in the next one. And remember, stay positive. Bye.